Assalamualaikum, I am Arif Asfa from Site 1 In this video, I will be sharing about my design ideas on Fisherman Village Center Our site is located in Kampung Badu, Pahang where their main source of income is from the sea The design concept is mostly inspired by the barnacles that is found a lot laying on the jetties there Barnacles shows a lot of beautiful trees that represent community of Balu Barnacles is formed in a colony and has repetitive shapes but differ in size, which represent hierarchy. People of Balog live together in a place and love gatherings. They share same culture but does different activities. Hierarchy is represented in the activities and numbers of people doing it. Barnacles are also found a lot deeper in water as there is more mineral down. As it goes up a column or pool, that are lesser as it is less exposed to the mineral and that actually give information on the tide changes at the water body and from all the inspiration therefore the concept of co coexisting with Balu is derived just like how Bernacles coexisting with the community of Balu the idea is to bring the fishermen, non-fishermen and natural environment coexist with each other the concept is applied in the arrangement of space where just as the barnacles is formed more towards more water the activities in space are also arranged from less activities to more activities it also means bringing the non-fishermen the locals and the visitor towards the culture of fishermen which is denser at the water so the non-fishermen coexist with the fishermen there the design also will coexist with the visitor by giving information on the beauty of Balu culture in the same time allows the local to benefit from the visitor in economy in the site planning the design lets the current existing jetty to coexist with the new additional jetty where the old one is used by the local fishermen and the new one is used for additional attraction for visitors so it does not disturb the existing culture there the site is divided into three zones where at the semi-public area visitors can witness the culture of the fishermen from the existing jetty and semi-private and private is placed quite far from the main public area the building is oriented from the road at the jetty as mentioned to let visitor and fishermen crisis as seen on the ground floor plan the spaces are placed like a colony focus on the strip in circulation just like the barnacles on a street pool the vinyl shop connects to a gallery where both spaces coexist with each other. When people want to see the exhibition, people have no choice but to go through the souvenir vinyl shop in and out and probably grab some goods before going home. Going straight, visitors will go through a bridge designed on a fish pond so that they can feel the culture of the sea itself and coexist with it as they see or feed the fish. Pass a ram on their head, the visitor will see a frozen item, shop, and a path with a boardwalk. The boardwalk actually leads to the wet market and also becomes a gap to not let, let the smell from the market coming into the building. From there too, they can already be seen and brought to the real culture of the fishermen outside the building, where they can go relaxing at the plaza or to the new attraction. They can also grab or rent equipment from the storage or stop by the toilet to wash up first. Going up there are two choices of path one through the stairs and another one through the ramp. The ramp actually brings the visitor to see the culture around the building and also get to see the view of the site from the upper height. Upstairs, there is a restaurant where people can enjoy eating fresh seafoods while looking outside to learn more about the culture. There, this is where the analogy of barnacles giving info to the people just like the design serve to give info to teach about the Balak community. There are also surau and admin office on the same floor as it is more private and less busy. From the admin office, the admins could coexist with the visitor by witnessing the activities done there from up high. I guess that's how, how the proposed design of Fisherman Village Visitor Center could coexist with the community of Malu and visitors. Thank you.